With every tick of the clock, it seems we are closer and closer to surpass the frontier of the two degrees. Deadly heat waves and ravaging wildfires, ever stronger storms and rising sea levels, and diminishing numbers of wildlife both on land and underwater leave more and more environmental victims on their path and especially affect the developing countries and regions. The climate crisis is no longer a point of view. Urgent action is needed. And international collaboration is crucial in order to restore human balance with nature. CAF, Development Bank of Latin America, is keen on supporting our member countries' efforts to achieve the Sustainable Development Goals, to change the path in their productive models to make consistent with the Paris Agreement, to contribute to mitigation with nature-based solutions that improve people's lives, and to support our region's voice as an essential player in global climatic discussions and actions. Following last year's announcement of allocating 25 billion U.S. dollars on a robust green strategy over the next five years. And more recently, a 1.2 billion US dollar commitment to ocean protection. CAF aims to become the Green and Blue Bank of Latin America and the Caribbean, which implies a commitment to achieving 40% of green portfolio by 2026. Our agenda is based on a territorial approach at the regional, national, local, and sectoral or thematic levels, which contemplates social responsibility, environmental sustainability, and development that is low in greenhouse gas emissions and resilient to climate change. Decisive steps have been taken towards the fulfillment of CAF's commitments with sustainable development and a greener future, with tangible actions such as 117 million U.S. dollars to help fight climate change in the Galapagos Islands and the protection of the Pacific Marine Corridor that benefits Costa Rica, Panama, Colombia and Ecuador. 231 million U.S. dollars destined toward the E-Motion project to promote electric mobility in Panama, Paraguay and Uruguay. Other lines of action include the fostering of fair energy transition, coastal sustainable tourism, and the I Nina Cui project of the highlands of Peru to help Andean families cope with the effects of climate change. The path towards achieving balance with nature while promoting inclusive economic growth is hard and complex but through the strengthening of alliances with strategic partners and the mobilization of the necessary climate financial resources, we are confident that there is hope in a better tomorrow for our region and the planet. CAF, Development Bank of Latin America.